Hello, everybody, and welcome to a to welcome to a new series that I played. I, I'm going to be playing actually, and uh, quite frankly, actually, someone asked me to play this. Which this is Pokemon Emerald for those who don't know, and uh, just so that way you so that way you do know, this is actually an emulated version on my PC. So I didn't couldn't really get a way to actually do it by Game Boy. Well, even though there's an easy way to do that, but GameCube's packed away, so this is the only way to do it. So, yeah, this is how the way I'm gonna play it. Actually, it's, uh, I'm kinda actually looking forward to wanting to play this, actually, to say the least. And if you do enjoy this content, please like, comment, and subscribe, and if you wanna follow the links down in the description to my Patreon page and become a patron for one dollar, that'd be greatly appreciated. So, yes. Yes. I've only played through this, uh, Pokemon Emerald once. I did it to test. I, I did this to test it out. So yeah, nobody cares about Jeff. And who's that? Me. So anyway. Hi. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch, or in other words, Professor Birch. As in, well, I guess there's no other way to put it. Anyway, but anyway, call. Everyone call, but any everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Like every other, like every other region, there's a perf professor, and this is what we call a Pokemon. Not like you haven't heard that before if you're well known to the story. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as far as known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times as friend, at times f as friendly playmates and. At times as cooperative teammates. And at times, worst rivals. I know, that happens. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. That's why I'm a professor, because I just don't know. So, in fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do, of course, because someone's gonna do it. And you are... Okay. Are you a boy? Or a girl? Well, I'm most certainly not a girl, so that's for sure. Alrighty, what's your name? Um, I think it's pretty straightforward. Yeah, if people call me casual, it's no, it's causal. C-A-U... Whoops. I made a mistake. I just I just did casual, not cuddle. Alright. That's the name I always give myself. There we go. Alright. So it's Kozzle. Yes. Ah, okay. You're Kozzle. Who's moving to my hometown of Little Root? <laughs> I've got it now. I got it. I get it now. All right, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon where, ev where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I've been expecting you, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me at my Pokemon lab. Yipper doodle. What I find hilarious about this is the fact that he's been shoved in the back of a truck. Not literally shoved, but he's been put in the back of a truck, and that's normal? I mean, if anything, that's horrible. And the mom comes out like, oh, thank goodness you're safe. Kazel, we're here, honey. It looked like something else, but anyway. It must be tiring riding with your, with our things in the moving truck. Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? This is our new home. We just got here, Mom. It has it has a quite fe quite feeling, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? I just got here, Mom. And you get your own room, Causal. Let's go inside. Oh, gee, not like I didn't have that before. See, Causal, isn't it nice in here too? I just got here. The movers. The movers Pokemon do all the work of moving us in, in clean, cleaning af up after. Isn't that right? <laughs> They'll just move around. 
moving it in and clean. Okay, this is so convenient. Kozel, your mo your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad bought bought you a new clock to mark our new our move in a move here. Don't forget to set it. Oh, I'll set it. See, they're just moving. Well, this one's. It's a. It's, yeah, in the in um in um I gotta set the clock. And what time is it? Better set it and start it. Well, let's see. It is nearly four o'clock, so. <laughs> All of a sudden, oh dear lord, it's running out of control. What the? P That's it? No, it's four. Well, I mean, okay, hold on. Okay, now it just turned 357, so yeah, all right. Kozel, how do you like your new room? I just got here. Good, everything's put away neatly. It's like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I mean, I just got here and you're asking me questions it's like, isn't it great? Great, I'm glad you like it. It's like, I just got here. We finished moving everything down in downstairs too. Pokemon movers are so convenient. Yeah, it's not like you put them to work or anything. <laughs> oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. Okay. All right, Kozel filled out the notebook. Adventure rule number one: open the. Okay, I don't. I don't need to. I don't need to know this stuff. I already know this stuff. All right, Kozel booted up your PC. Okay, would you like? Okay, that's not important. It's really not important. Right. Oh, Kozel, Kozel, quick, come quickly. Oh, now you're demanding I look, huh? <laughs> look, it's Petalburg Jim. Maybe Dad will be on. Interfere. We brought, we brought, brought you this report from in front of the Petalburg Jim. Gee whiz. Oh, it's over. Oh, well, that was helpful. I think Dad was on, but we missed him. Too bad. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, one of Dad's friends lives in the in town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door, so... Oh, yeah, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Gee whiz. It's not like... It's not like I just got here or anything, but okay. Uh... Oh, hello, lady. Oh, hello. And you are? <laughs> blah, 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 Oh, you're Kozel, our new next door neighbor. Hi. We have a daughter about the same age as you. Oh, it's like you knew how old I was even though I didn't tell you. Our daughter was excited about making a new friend. Mm, okay. A little suspicious, but okay. Our daughter is upstairs, I think. Oh. Easy prey, I must say. Okay, but what the? Uh. Huh? Who? Who are you? She said you were up here. Oh, you're causal. So you you move. Your move was today. Yeah, that was exactly what happened. Uh, I'm May. Oh, I'm glad I didn't have to name you anything. Glad to meet you. I I have this dream of becoming friends. With Pokemon all over the world. Mm. I I heard about you, Causal, from my dad, Professor Birch. I was hoping that you would be nice, Causal, and that we could be friends. Okay. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I I've just met you, Causal. Hehehe. <laughs> okay. I mean, if okay, never mind. Oh no, I forgot. I was supposed supposed to help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. Kozel, I'll I'll catch you later. It's Maze Pokeball. Better leave it. Okay. Okay. Well, off to the professor's lab, I guess, which is down here. Okay. Professor Birch is here. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, look at that! No one's here. Huh? Professor Birch. Professor's away on field work. Argo. Wait, is that what he just said? Argo? He isn't here. Oh, let me explain what field work is. It is to study things in natural, the, the natural environment, like fr uh, fields and mountains, instead of the la of a laboratory. 
the professor isn't one for doing desk work. He's the type of prof person who would rather go outside and experience things than read them here. Actually, that's kind of what I would do, just do the experience of it all. Even though I'm not really an outdoorsy person, but that's not the point. Alright, here we go this way. Oh, hello, li little lady. Um, hi. There are scary Pokemon outside. I can hear them, their cries. I want to go see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. Can you go? Can you go see what's happening for me? Sure. Help! Uh, help me! Wait a minute. Is that a zigzag goon? Yes. Hello, you over there. Please help! In my bag, there's a Pokeball. <laughs> okay. Check. Nope. Mud kit. Nope. Uh, Trico? No. Torchic every time. But actually, it'd be so funny if I just stood there, just kind of, just like, huh, do I pick this one or that one? And he's just running around, and the professor's just running around in circles, trying to evade the zigzagoon. And he's just like, just pick one! Pick anyone! You're just like, I, I, I just can't! So, yeah, I'll just pick zigzag, uh, bleh, zigzagoon, no. Torchic. I need to turn this up. There we go. That way I can be all nostalgic and whatnot. All right. All right. And the sound is a little off. I'll have to figure out a way to fix that. Ornberry. Oh, jeez. I gotta get used to the um, the B button, the A button, just being in different spots because I'm using the Xbox One controller. Oh, and I know that's not very Nintendo-like, but. Eh. It's like, I don't care. Okay. Professor Birch. Whew. I was in the in the tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped. Literally or figuratively? Oh, literally. Sorry. Anyway. But were you pounced on or were you... Never mind. We'll talk about that later. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh. Hi. Uh, you're causal. You're causal. This is not the pl place to chat, so come by. by my Pokemon lab later, okay? Yes, because if anything, we're not in the tall grass or anything. So, Kozl, I've heard so much about uh, you from your father. I've heard that you don't ha have your own Pokemon yet, but the way you you battled earlier, you pulled you pulled it, it off with a pulp. I don't know. I guess you'll you'll have you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh yes, that's. As thanks for rescuing me, I'd like you to have the Pokemon you used earlier. Kozl received Torchic. Yep, or do Well, you're at it. While you're at it, why not give it a nickname? Uh, no, I don't do <laughs> nicknames. If you work at Poke, if you work at Pokemon and gain experience, you I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Puzzle. Don't you think it might be a good idea to go see May? Sure? Professor. Oh, wait. Great. May should be happy to. Get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. Okay. I guess I'll head back to there and simply say, Hey, May, can you, oh, I don't know, help me with things that I already know? That's what happens. Wait. Oh, she, I thought she was looking in there, just kind of like... I'm just the peeping Tom, don't mind me. And jeez, she's not even here. It's a Nintendo GameCube. The Game Boy Advance is connected to serve as a controller. Oh yeah. Oh, the good days. Even though people will always say that the um, even though people will always say the GameCube was never as good as the. Okay, so where do I need to go? Probably back to my house. Yeah, but anyway, they say that they said that the GameCube was beat out by the Xbox and the PlayStation 2 just dominated that generation, but it's like, I don't really care. I like, I like the, um, okay, so it's back up to full health. I like the fact that, um, oh, okay. I like the fact that, um, you can do some little bit of training. Just a little bit. I do like the fact that it was just, Nintendo's much more nostalgic than anything else. So. 
just a little bit of training, even though I'm a little over the 15 minute mark, but hey, not overly important. As long as everybody enjoys this, this is all that matters. I intend to enjoy myself. Honestly, I wish this was, um, more, oh, uh, well, actually I was heading this way anyway, so it didn't matter. So I'm wishing that this was, um, Oh, it was like, um, damn it, Omega Ruby or Alpha Sapphire, but it's kind of like, eh, it's still okay. This is still good. Still have to finish. Okay. So where am I supposed to go? That is my question. Well, until I find May, I'm not quitting the episode. Yet. So easy. A child can do it. Anyway. Talk to the mother. Oh, May went uh, went, uh, uh, went out to Route Three just a little while ago. Like father, like child, May can't stay quiet at home, unfortunately. All right. Well, I guess in the I guess I'll just uh, end the episode right here. I mean, I'm gonna keep going, so it's not really a big deal. But I'll just end the episode right here. So if you do enjoy this content, please like, comment, and subscribe. And you will follow me. To follow me. If you want to follow the link down in the description to my Patreon page and become a patron, that'd be greatly appreciated. For, well, yeah, one dollar or so, but it'd be greatly appreciated. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I will see you guys next time.